All right guys, so in my previous video, I did the whole pit bike build, but right now I'm going to take apart the case to the motor and install this new ignition coil I got. Because the old one is bad and this may or may not have cracked. It came cracked, so I don't feel as bad, but I'm gonna start taking all the bolts out. Set all of these aside. Some at the bottom too. Now this this pit bike I actually bought for sixty dollars and I spent probably forty dollars, probably twenty dollars in paint and and another twenty dollars in the ignition coil and it was a package deal so it came with another carburetor. Show that right here. I don't think I'm gonna install it because uh. The old one is fine. Just like that. I'll see if I can get all up and close right here. Alright, so all you need to do is take these off right here. Once you have those, the magnet would want to stick, so you just take it out. And there it is right there. You have to unplug that. Pretty sure it, it is a plug, yeah. So unplug that. And set this bum one aside. Now we got the new one. <clears throat> so, let's see if I can put that. So, there we go. It's pretty easy. Just want to put it on like this. Now we need to tighten it up.
Now that that's tight, bring this around. It should be able to just go right through there. Should. I'll have to do this off camera, it won't take long. Alright guys, so the pit bike is finally done. I'll show you what I did after the video that I wasn't able to do before the end of it because I just way too much. So first thing I did is I installed the new spark plug boot, the new spark plug. I got the chain guard on and then I got a new tailpipe that I welded on there. Not the best weld, but it'll hold. And I also put this on there because that tailpipe gets so hot, I burnt through my pants. It was, I don't know, it was not good. So I ended up putting that on there. It doesn't look the best, but whoever buys it will definitely want it on there. Um, I still have not fully put the gas tank on. I just have it strapped down with one zip tie. I still need to get that. But other than that, this thing is ready to go. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys starting it up and then I'm going to drive it around. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe.